Hello there. Nearly ready. Uh, <coughs> excellent book. Oof. Very exciting. I'll try and get straight on with it in about one minute. Just scan a bit of quote at the beginning. I don't want to mess it up. Quote from Giordano Bruno. It is proof of a base and low mind for one to wish to think with the masses or majority merely because the majority is the majority. Truth does not change because it is or is not believed by a majority of the people. What's going down? Chapter 1. I remember a song, sorry, oh dear. I've seen it up already, right, so it's this um, Dream by David Knight, chapter one, what's going down, here's another quote, E.B. White from E.B. White, a library is a good place to go when you feel bewildered or undecided, for there is in a book you may have your questions answered. I remember a song when I was growing up in the 1960s called For What It's Worth by the Canadian-American band Buffalo Springfield. The lyrics said, there's something happening here. What it is ain't exactly clear. The chorus demanded, everybody look what's going down. The story goes that the band member, that a band member, Stephen Stills, was heading into Hollywood to a live music show when he came across a big protest by young people over a curfew and the closing down of a club known as Pandora's Box, still recalled in 1971. A bunch of kids got together on the street corner and said, we aren't moving. About three busloads of Los Angeles police showed up, who looked very much like stormtroopers. And I looked at it and said, Jesus, America is in great danger. Still wrote that, for what it's worth, no oh idea, I'm not reading this very well. I think I'm going to start again in a few minutes. I think I've got a bit ambitious and trying to plan it straight in. So I'll just relax a bit. I'll put a bit of intro music on and I'll start the whole book again in about 10 minutes. Right. Um, right, I'll put a little bit of music on in the background, have a bit of tea. It's worth waiting for if I can get it together to read properly. I'm not doing David Icke any justice. Uh, I'm trying to. Well, I will be doing. Hopefully. I did well last night. Did a little bit last night. Right.
Right. <clears throat> What's going down? Chapter one. A library is a good place to go when you feel bewildered or undecided. For there, in a book, you may have your question answered. E.B. White. I remember a song when I was growing up in the 1960s called For What It's Worth by the Canadian-American band Buffalo Springfield. The lyrics said, there's something happening here. It ain't exactly clear. The chorus demanded, everybody look what's going down. The story goes that a band member, Stephen Sills, was heading into Hollywood to do a live music show when he came across a big protest by young people over a curfew and the closing of a club known as Pandora's Box. Sills recalled in 1971, a bunch of kids got together on a street corner and said we aren't moving. About three busloads of Los Angeles police showed up who looked very much like stormtroopers. And I looked at it and said, Jesus, America is in great danger. Stills wrote for what it's worth after what he saw that night and included in the lyrics. Oh dear, I'm not reading this very well. <sighs> yeah, I think I'm going to start the stream again because I've just messed up. I think I need to wake up. So if I come back on in about an hour or something like that. <sighs> because I'm just not awake enough. I'm not firing on all cylinders. Or cylinder. <laughs> well, I don't know. Perhaps I'll just carry on burbling for a bit. I need to go and brush my teeth and things like that and freshen up a little bit more. I did wash my face and stuff. I thought I was ready, but I've got, I don't know, you know, furry tongue. I'm drinking black tea because there's no milk because they're not providing the proper facilities here for me because I'm uh, mostly vegan. So I don't do cow milk, so I have oat milk, you know, but uh, there wasn't any, unfortunately. So, there we go. Uh, it is what it is. Anyway, it's a fantastic book. Yeah, all I need to do is read the book, to read the first chapter to myself, read it out loud to myself, and then come back on live and do it again when I think I'm in the flow, when I've got the flow together, because I can read quite well when I'm, uh, well, I like to think so, when I'm uh, on form. 
but uh, I'm just I'm just not hitting up because I don't understand that it's not fair. Well, David, so uh, yeah, so it's not fair on me either. But I'm looking pretty incompetent at the moment. <laughs> Wonderful job. It's always the way with my uh, live streams. Quite often can be. Well, you know, we try. We try. That's all we can do. We try. The mainstream won't. Uh, you know, give you any information about anything whatsoever that's really important. It's all fair, fair, fair. Nothing else, nothing positive at all. Anyway, I'm uh, digressing. Right, so what I'm going to do, I'll end it now, and I'll do some practice, and then I'll come back in about, I don't know, say seven o'clock or something like that and have another go. Okay. Cheers. Thanks very much. Bye bye.